everybody. It's Allie from Padfoot Palms, and I'm here with Iceland. Say hi to everybody. Okay, you can have a tongue lick. That means hello. <laughs> okay, so um, I got some new brushes today, and I wanted to show everybody because Iceland here hates absolutely hates to be brushed and I know that this is a problem for a lot of Pomeranians a lot of dogs in general they just really don't enjoy being brushed but look how pretty she is when she is brushed so anyway I have been on the hunt for something with kind of like a slicker brush a setup but with softer spines, bristles, bristles. Hey, let's go with that. So the problem with slicker brushes, if you've ever touched one, you know, they it, it's like daggers, right? When you touch it. And I can't imagine that that feels good on their skin. So this is the brush that I got. It's from PetSmart. Um, it's the Conair line, which I think is humorous. Um, it has this gel kind of squishy handle, so the handle feels nice. And these, let me see if I can get a close up here. You see how it's got the little bulbs at the end? They are very soft and they don't um, rake across their skin like most slicker brushes. And I apologize for the hair in this one. Um, I did test it out on Iceland, so that's why it's got hair in it. Um, anyway, those little bulbs, I mean, it just makes a huge difference. And these bristles, as you can see, they have a lot of give. They are not super stiff, which again, means that when you're pulling it through the hair, you're not raking it across their skin. Um, so there's that. Uh, at PetSmart, they were running a 50% off sale on grooming supplies. So I also got the dematting rake. Now, I do not recommend that you get one of these and use it if you have not been taught by a groomer how to use it. Um, this does not mean that you can, you know, let your dog get mats and then you get one of these and you brush through it and everything's fine. Um, this is like a, a last resort before shaving type of deal. Um, I got this because we have two dogs who like to roll in the mud and the muck and jump in puddles. So they get um, all kinds of mats and tangles and I like to preserve their coat whenever possible. Um, and then also, I just wanted to throw out that we got some more of these minnows. Um, these are from uh, Only Natural Pet. There's the brand right there. And as you can see, the ingredients are minnows. And that's it. That's fantastic. I love to see a treat that has one ingredient. Um, these minnows are freeze dried. Um, on the flip side, if you have an Asian grocery store near you, you can find these for a lot cheaper than you can at the pet stores um, because they are actually sold as snacks for humans. Go figure. Um, there'll be a variety of shrimp and fish and all of that. So anyway, that's all I've got for you today. So I hope that you find this helpful. I hope that, you know, this slicker brush is something that'll work for you and your palm. Um, I know that we have gone through quite a few brushes um, because both Gooby and Iceland have sensitive skin. So they do not like to be brushed at all and we have to do it very gently. So I hope that helps. Hope you have a great day. Hit that like button if you found this to be helpful and we'll see you on the next one.